This is Sunday, May the 3rd, and we're looking at the Black River. I'm in uh, Patterson State Park, Wisconsin. I'm standing on an old CCC constructed uh, bridge across the Black River. Beautiful hiking day. Hiking along the beautiful Black River. Got the trail all to myself here today and a beautiful Sunday day. Don't understand that. Dry trail. Warm day, dry trail, dry feet. What a beautiful thing. We're now nearing uh, Little Manitou Falls on the Black River, Patterson State Park, Wisconsin. These are the Little Manitou Falls, drop about 40 feet. The uh, highest waterfall in uh, Wisconsin is about a mile and a half down this same river, the Black River. And the Big Manitou, I think they drop about 100 feet. I just took the trail by here. Impressive enough for me. This is Monday, May the 4th. I've just pulled off the road here, have a little bit of lunch. These folks haven't posted their place, so I've just kind of moved in here to their picnic table. Last two days I've passed hundreds and hundreds of these summer retreats. Folks from Chicago and Milwaukee, Detroit come up to these places in the summertime. No one's got up here yet. They come up here to try to save their sanity and a little breathe, have a little breathing space and uh, a little fresh air here certainly for their breathing space in the process. And I'm really roughing it today too. I'm just getting ready to uh, have my dessert. The rest of my Reese's peanut butter cups. This is Tuesday, May the 5th. And uh, I'm trekking in the footsteps of the great voyagers on a portage this morning. If you look at my journal entry for this day, you'll see the details about it. There are monuments along, as I, and as I pass, of these great voyagers. Here's one from 1803. This old portage being used and passed by the voyagers of over 200 years ago. Again, this is Tuesday, May the 5th. I'm hiking uh, along the Bruel St. Croix section of the uh, North Country National Scenic Trail. It has turned to be just an absolutely beautiful, beautiful, incredible day. This is some of the finest groomed, well marked, some of the really neatest trail that I've been on this entire journey so far. Can you hear the wind in the pines? What a beautiful, cool, relaxing 
hiking day. On the North Country National Scenic Trail in the beautiful state of Wisconsin. This is Friday, May the 8th, and I am at Copper Falls State Park, Wisconsin. The Cascades here, the rapids and the falls we're looking at now is just one section. This is the Black River coming down through here. Go down a little farther and see if we can uh, get some more. Excuse me, did I say Black River? It's the Bad River. Tyler Forks plunges 30 feet below you into the Bad River Gorge. How did the gentle valley of Tyler Forks and this deep gorge form side by side? First, the waters in Tyler Fork cut across solid beds of basalt, whereas the water in the Bad River cuts along a fracture. Water erodes basalt along a fracture line. It does that more easily than when it flows over solid beds. In this case, the result is Collar Fork Cascade. A series of four tumbling, turbulent falls. Second, Collar Fork simply has less water volume and therefore less power to erode the